Hey guys, uh, just got home a little bit ago from a toy hunt. Well, yeah, toy hunt, I guess. Uh, I got a few things I'm going to show you and tell you what I think of them. Uh, first off, I got the Star Trek Lieutenant Ohora Barbie. Um, she came, I, I've already undressed her and been playing with her. She's a lot of fun. She's really cute. She's uh, $34.99. She came dressed in her Lieutenant O'Hara outfit. And she came with her little her little reader that this thing flips up. And has a little metallic sticker on it that gives you readings. And then she also came with her communicator that flips up. And it's, it's actually the communicator inside. And then she comes in these really cool black go-go boots but i've been playing with her um so i have her dressed like this <laughs> she's going out in the town now this doll is really 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 pretty um she has peach tone lips um she's just a gorgeous doll let me see if i can get a better light of her there we go gorgeous doll she has a little spit curl on the su on each side and her green earrings. Um, she has like a partial made to move body. Her she's jointed at her her shoulder, her for her forearm, double jointed elbow, wrist, double jointed knee, her ankle is not jointed and she's not jointed in the chest. And she came wearing these black nylons that have red panties made in up at the top. She does, however, have a lot of a lot of product in her hair, which is understandable. That's how she else is going to keep that that uh, curl at the top and this bump. But I'm thinking of washing some of this out. But she's just a gorgeous, gorgeous doll. Um, I'm so glad they did a no horror doll. I mean, the Spock and and the Spock and the um, Kirk doll. I'm I'm not really interested in because I can't stand um, William Shatner for personal reasons but um the other doll i got is the new uh fashion curvy fashionista fashion pack i got this one and the reason i got her she looks like she might be half like she she kind of looks half asian half 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 hispanic or asian hispanic or white you never know i got her because she's the only one of the curvy ones that have really high heels and this this is just my 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 thing on it i'm glad they made a curvy doll as, as i've said in the past i'm really happy that they went out and made a curvy doll but you know they gave her high heel shoes but they're like sensible high heel shoes they're not cool and sexy you know they're lace up black platformed high heel shoes now Here's the thing for me, is Mattel, on their their uh, media department, puts out pictures of Barbie on Instagram all the time. And now they've been putting a lot of the curvy dolls on the Instagram pictures. But they put the curvy dolls that have the made-to-move body. Are they, my question for you, Mattel, is are you going to make a curvy doll with a made-to-move body? Because I would buy one, but... Preferably, more than anything, Mattel, please bring back rubber legs. Please bring back those soft vinyl legs, the pop and click legs. Bring back the rubber legs. Hashtag rubber leg. Please bring those back. Those are the best dolls. And Mattel, you know, you you bring back the great accessories like you used to have back in the day. Back in the day, these these tatters and tears would have been real instead of just printed but she is a really cute doll her hair is, is is incredibly soft she doesn't have like eight pounds of product in it and look squishy head so there's not a ton of glue inside of her head and you can even make her look like an adult cabbage patch kid see <laughs> she's really cute i like her a lot um she came with this outfit which is like 
a skirt that I think is supposed to look like sweatpant material, and then a top that has like Paris backgrounds on it, it says fashionista all over it, and then she came with like a cocktail like dress. This here, plaid, and then she came with a pair of white high top tennis shoes and a messenger bag purse. This was nineteen ninety nine. I love the doll itself. Um, I really love her. She's super adorable. Super great. And I love the color of hair. The honey blonde. Great, great hair. And she is going to go into my permanent collection. I'm not going to get rid of her. And the other thing I got was... I got the Endless Hair Kingdom African American Barbie. I... Now that I have both of them side by side... She, I like her so much better. Her hair, I love the color of hair they went with her and the purple streaks in it. Um, her dress I like a lot better. It seems like they actually put more thought into this dress because this dress has three layers of tulle as the other one only had one. <laughs> and I think maybe because I got like the first wave of them. And her head's a lot small. Her hair head's a lot narrower on this one. Now... This is my blonde one. Uh, shock for a moment. Um, she is in the process of going to be getting new hair. So, <laughs> but look how much smaller the African American doll's head is compared to Barbie. Her head's a lot narrower. Her head is a lot rounder and more cartoony. Um, I think the her this one smiles a lot bigger. Her smile's a little bit more subdued, and I like that. And uh, anyway, like I was saying, this Barbie. She's getting a reroute by me. Um, I just have to wait for her hair to get here, but she is getting rerouted. But yeah, she's so. This one's so pretty. I love the, the 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 dusty rose eye shadow she has on. She's just all around. I think a lot prettier than the than the blonde one. And the one I can't wait till I get my new hair to reroute. I'm only gonna reroute the blonde, the blonde one. This one I'm not gonna mess with because she's. She's perfect for me. I think she's just lovely. So that's what I got today. And then um, I saw some cool stuff, new stuff that they have, like play, play line wise at Toys R Us. They have this new um, Barbie. She's fourteen ninety nine, and she's called uh, Heart Hands Barbie. And she comes like this, and you push her arms together, and she does that in front of her chest and when she does that when her hands lock together and do a heart it's like actually it's like this when her hands come together and make the heart the heart lights up on her chest it doesn't make any noise it just goes together and lights up and it's 14.99 it's really cute and then they had another doll there from this new i guess it's going to be a new barbie movie or something and it's called um rainbow kingdom rainbow kingdom something yeah rainbow kingdom anyway i'm going to try to bring up a picture of it um the doll has a made on bodice but it's clear she has a clear bodice and then she has like a she has a little um disc on her back that when you push the button on her blouse her blouse lights up in rainbows and then it projects um images onto her hair in the background and her she's got this ponytail that has a clip on it that goes up and has this little thing on it to make her hair go into like a waterfall. And so it can project, that's it. So it can project, see those lights behind her? That's the light from her back projecting on her hair. And it changes three different colors, pink, pink, purple, and blue. And it plays a little chime. And that one is uh, $19.99 as well. And they also had, oh, there's the, there's the heart hand Barbie. Her dress just says love all over it. So yeah, that's what I got. And I just wanted to show, I'm sorry for showing you pictures on my phone. I know that's like super cheesy and whatnot. But um, I wanted to show you guys that and tell you guys, uh, please, if you're interested, follow me on Instagram, Matthews3867. Um, I would love to have you guys follow me. Um, I answer questions. Um, I answer quite as many questions as I can as I get 
on uh, on YouTube. So let me know, guys. Uh, love you. Uh, sorry for a short vid, but yeah, that's all I got were these three things, and they're awesome. So yeah. Oh, sorry. No, no, I did not. I got that fashion pack on O'Hara, and I got this dress on for O'Hara too. It's a really cute dress. It has this tool in the front, but unfortunately, it doesn't carry over to the back. So anyway, that's it. Uh, love you guys. Bye.